Hey everyone, welcome back to another Halo video. Now today's video I've got something cool to show you for you Halo fans. We're diving into a modded version of Halo Combat Evolved, where instead of uh, playing as the Super Soldier Master Chief, we're taking on the role of a vulnerable Marine. That's right, we're stepping into the boots of an ordinary soldier uh, in one of the most terrifying missions of the game, 243 Guilty Spark. I mean, I've heard the library mission was pain in the ass and took forever to finish, but 343 Guilty Spark mission has always been a fan favorite for its uh, horror elements. But playing, uh, playing it as a marine, it takes the experience to a whole new level. Without the enhanced abilities and shield of a Spartan, every encounter with the flood becomes a life or death uh, struggle. Just look at this, as a marine, you're more fragile, more human, the flood feel more menacing and more overwhelming. Every bullet counts and every corner could be your last. You don't even have an AI with you uh, like Master Chief had, you know, how Master Chief does with the Cortana, where Cortana guys Master Chief. Uh, and the hood is different too to a Spartan. Uh, I've also noticed that there's no reticle on your weapons, unless if you're zooming in with your pistol or with, or, or with your sniper rifle, uh, you, would, you, know, you would have a reticle. So you have to be more careful on how you aim without it. So it's way more challenging and kind of realistic in a way. This got me thinking, wouldn't it be incredible if we had a official Halo uh, a game you know, built around this concept? A horror Halo spin-off game where you play as a vulnerable Marine fighting to survive against the Flood? Just imagine, imagine a game powered by the Unreal Engine with stunning visuals and atmospheric uh, sound design. Uh, you're part of a small squad cut off from the reinforcement, uh, you know, navigating through the dark corridors, abandoned facilities and infested swamps. The tension will be insane. Uh, the feel will be real. You'd have to rely on your uh, limited resources and your squad mates to, to survive. The focus will not be on being a one-man army. But as a teamwork. The flood will be relentless and every victory will feel earned. I don't want to have a Spartan or even a ODST you know to be in the uh, spin-off uh, Halo game because I'm very curious on how playing as a marine only will play out. You know you and your uh, uh, co-op bodies you know if, if, if everyone's playing as a, as a marine yeah I want to see how the atmosphere I want to see what, what that will feel like you know just playing as a marine and you know the experience of it. With a rear engine, we could have detail, detailed environments, really like you know, realistic lighting and dynamic weather effects to enhance the horror experience. Imagine the creeping dread of moving through a flood-invested facility during a thunderstorm, with uh, lightning flashes, flashes, and you know, uh, revealing the horrors are lurking in the shadows. A Halo a horror spin-off will not only expand the Halo universe, but uh, also offer a terrifying perspective. It will bring back the survival horror elements that, that the fans know and love from Halo Combat Evolved but with the uh, added intensity of the Halo universe. Like imagine playing as Jenkins in this mission with Captain Keys and, uh, you know, and Soldier Johnson. I mean we've seen it with the recorded version where Master Chief watches the video. Uh, like I want to know what happens to him after afterwards you know when he escapes. Uh, I think he I think he dies in Halo 2 but but we could still have a spin-off Halo game about him. Uh, there is potential for, for him to have a spin-off game uh, for Jenkins. Uh, I'll be interested to see, you know, how he, you know, survived, you know, after, you know, when he like left the crew, left the left the squad, uh, while you know they were getting attacked. So, what do you guys all think? You know, would you want to see a Halo game like this? You know, spin-off Halo game? Uh, because I would love to see this. You know, I don't want to see a remake or a reboot. You know, at least not by three four three. They're just gonna end up ruining it. Uh, just give us a, a good damn, you know, uh, camping uh, flood horror game, you know. I, I do think another studio should be making a, a spin-off Halo game. I feel like Team 3 might not have the capabilities pulling off a good spin-off Halo game. Uh, I don't know, that's just me, I guess. Uh, but I really do believe, you know, we do deserve a, a good spin-off Halo game. Because we had, a, you know, a couple of spin-off games like ODST, Halo 3 ODST and Reach. And those were really good. Those were, like, I really had, you know, amazing time playing those games. Uh, so I would love to see a flood, uh, horror spin-off game. Let me know down in the comments below. Uh, would you guys want a, a spin-off Halo uh, Halo game uh, based off from the flood, or just have you know Halo C remake? You know, even though I don't want that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and follow us on Twitch. I do stream Halo on Twitch. Uh, you guys can come over to Twitch and just you know we could talk about Halo you know in general. Uh, so yeah, go ahead and drop a follow, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everyone.